Welcome to Philadelphia for the inaugural Premier Lacrosse League Championship presented by Savills. Talon Energy Stadium for Redwoods and Whip Snakes. There can only be one first, and one of these teams is walking out of here as the first champions of the PLL. The league was announced in October of last year. It came to life this spring. Training camp in May, the first ever game was on the first day of June. And now two days away from the start of fall, the championship game between Redwoods and Whipsnakes. This league may be in its first season, but it is comprised of the best players in the world. On Thursday night, Matt Rambo, here in his hometown of Philadelphia, was named MVP of the league. Yep. At faceoff X, Joe Nardella finished second overall in, say, in face off percentage. But today, he goes up against one of the all-time greats in Greg Gurenlian. The 35-year-old has won 57% so far during the playoffs. He came out of retirement to be part of the inaugural season of the PLL, and you have to wonder if we could be watching the final game of his incredible career. Whip Snakes finished with the second best record in the regular season and put together a convincing win over Chaos to get them to the championship game. Redwoods had to keep on winning to make it here. They've won three in a row, all elimination games. And now the championship to be determined here in Philadelphia. <laughs> Opening face off is available. And Michael Earhart will track it down and Whip Snakes get the game's first possession. Kavanaugh in a sprint pulls up just outside the crease, shoots and scores! Kavanaugh is so deadly coming from this left wing. You're gonna see a little pick. Muller's gotta navigate that, actually gets tripped up. Young is there to help, but Kavanaugh so tough, so strong. So identifying him late. Rambo and Landis. The matchup we're watching today, and Rambo has the early advantage. He's got no problem creating some real estate on Landis Island. He posts up, rated kind of five and five. Against Young, ball drop that comes right though to Joe Walters. Over to Kyle Harrison, moves it down. Skip pass for Kavanaugh and Burnlor with a big stop. Battle now plays for Mike Chanichuk. He can hammer it from two and Trotter is ready for that one. Mike Chanichuk took more two-point shots than anyone as a turnover and Snyder won't go off the bar. He has really lit it up in the last couple games. Brian, you talked about this being the most exciting 1-1 game. These are the two most exciting defenses. It's like watching, oh, and there's a shot. And it's John Hawes from Matt Rambo to give Whips the lead. The first goal of the second quarter comes nearly four minutes in. After the first faceoff, um, as you can see, it's taking a little bit longer than that. So I think, you know, we're starting to get there both offensively and defensively. As you can see with another goal, so hopefully we can start to settle in and, and you know, just play our brand of lacrosse. Looks like they might have, Brendan. And now it's Chanichuk. They give him no space at all. Seven two-pointers during the regular season. It comes to the crease, and it's put back by Carlson. Jay Carlson. It was a three goal in two and a half minute outburst for Whipsnakes as Matt Rambo feeds Lacasio with the bouncer. Joe Lacasio with a perfectly placed bounce shot. Just a few seconds here to go. Three seconds. Adams. A heave and he scores! Brett Adams from a two-pointer and it's a two-goal game here at half and was that deflection inside or outside of the two-point arc as some extracurricular activities going on and i believe after the conference the officials are saying it's a one he Absolutely. does get a piece. yeah yeah right off the head of the stick john hawes takes it around the crease hawes top side shoot scores John Hawes, two goals here in the championship game. 
Hawes on the run. And he scores! A John Hawes hat trick. And it's 7-2 Whipsnakes. And he gets Four it. minutes to go in the third quarter. Chanichuk from two, and he scores! She's in again. A beautiful skip pass there by Hawes. A little something you can hang your hat on. The dive, and they score! Let's see if he was able to stay out of the crease. It looks like there's some green between that shoe and the crease, so that looks clean there. What an individual effort by Near. Adams on Chanichuk for Kavanaugh. Fed in tight. Garnsey scores! Ryder Garnsey on the run. The last two for ones here late in the third quarter. Steals it away from Nordella. Garenlian punches over for Berg. Stopped by Berlore. Huge stop there for the Whip Snakes goaltender. Huge momentum savings stop there by Burnlore. Near. Perk of it calling for it from way out. He got it! Finds this open space up top. Kind of gets lost off ball. Sensing the opportunity late in the quarter. Why not? And through a sea of bodies. On the run. A little spin, rolled back right into traffic. Kavanaugh hangs onto the ball, though. Gets bumped again. Ball on the ground. Young trying to use the feet. It's kicked out of the pile. Over comes Perkovic. He wanted to play the body and did. The ball still lay there. It swatted back right to Bernhardt. And then Garzi wouldn't let it go. Popped in the air. Berg wrestling for it. Young tied up, and it's Garzi. And a wide open chance, and they score! We'll try to follow this ball, scrum after scrum. You can see guys just fight for it, fighting for it. Berg actually puts his glove back on, I think, during that scrum. Here you thought maybe the whips were going to come out of it, but Garnsey comes up with the hustle play and then sprints down and actually gets that loose ball. That, folks, was all Garnsey on two separate occasions. He made the play to keep that alive. Matt Rambo, quiet here in the second half. Dealing with a wrap check from near. Still it's Rambo, skips it across. Connor Kelly, got it! Connor Kelly ends the 5-0 run for Woods. One of the hottest team in the league coming into the game as Jules Henningberg shot miss. Kavanaugh picks it up, Garnsey, tough angle shot, he scores! Woods get it right back. Garnsey from Garenlium, the ball popped to Rambo. Trotter makes the save and sends it to midfield for Brett Adams. Adams on the run, down the alley, got it! Ten, nine. Half a quarter to play and the championship in the belts. Perkovic. Dug out, put back by Berg, and it's tied! You're going to see Berg if they get to the middle of the field. Burlor's all over the first one, but I don't even know if he catches this. It almost seems like he bats it right into the cave. Out high for Adams. Working on Bernhardt, opens up, wide open, Walter scores! Redwoods lead! And it's only fitting that the lone turf Puts the Redwoods on top. Their first lead since what? One to nothing? Three minutes and one second into the game. It's Drew Snyder with the initial possession. Rambo will come get it. Matt Rambo got a pick and a little bit of room, and he scores to tie it. Philadelphia's own Matt Rambo. So you're going to see this flip. Freeze it right here. You can see Landis get a little caught up in that pick. And look at all this daylight. So Rambo bends in. Landis tries to catch up with an overhead check, a little trail check. But you can see that slight pick gets Landis a little bit off of his angle. And the MVP 
Steps up huge. Ty Ward with his sprints to the near side of the field to get it to Matt Rambo. Rambo swims on Landis, gets topside. Rambo scores! Whip snakes are the first to wear the crown champions of the PLL. In his collegiate career, he was denied in Philadelphia. Today, Brendan, the MVP put his team on his shoulders late. I mean, this is a heavyweight matchup. This is Rambo on Landis. He gets far enough upfield. He's just such a load. He's able to generate enough momentum heading back to the cage. Right there, you can see him be able to turn the corner. And Coach Stagnita highlighted at halftime. We have to get the ball to Rambo. He got it late and he got it done. Rambo with the game tying goal with 21 seconds remaining in regulation and the game winning goal 28 seconds into overtime. The MVP of the PLL also gets the game winning goal. And as he hugged with Jim Stagnita, Mike Chanichuk gave him the Gatorade back. Thank you, Philadelphia. Unbelievable. Let's go, let's go. I want to thank our weekend sponsors, Savills, Icebreakers, Corning Gorilla Glass, and Vineyard Vines. And now, to congratulate the first ever Premier Lacrosse League champion, the Whip Snakes Lacrosse Club. And now for the first ever PLL Championship MVP with three goals and three assists, my man, Matt Rambo! That champagne celebration sometimes reserved for locker rooms and other sports here in the PLL. They do it right on the field as soon as the game is over. You knew they were going to drink from it, right? Whip Snakes, champions of the Premier Lacrosse League.